Hi everyone, I'm Mr. Mike, and I'm back for week two of God's Good Creation, VBS 2021. Now, if you're joining us for the first time this summer, God's Good Creation VBS is a hybrid vacation Bible school from several area Lutheran congregations. It's open to everyone who wants to learn a little bit more about God's awesome love for all of us. We are very excited to be offering both virtual learning and in-person learning opportunities. Now, for the next four weeks, on Mondays, you will be able to access this opening video as well as some really cool yoga videos. All of this is to help you prepare for a fun-filled Wednesday of in-person and virtual VBS activities at New Hanover Lutheran Church. There is an adult VBS offering from 10 to 11.30 on Wednesday mornings, and then kids of all ages can join us Wednesday evening from 6.30 to 8. Now, if you're traveling or feel more comfortable being at home, you can join us virtually as well. Check out the VBS website here for more details. Okay, now that we've reviewed all of that, it's time to get started on this week's opening video. Our theme this week is God can use you whatever size you are. In this verse from chapter 13 in the Gospel of Matthew, we hear Jesus telling a parable, which is a little story that teaches a lesson. This story focuses on how a little tiny mustard seed can grow into a mighty tree. Now, if you have some time before Wednesday, grab your Bible and find Matthew 13 verses 31 to 32 to read the whole story. Maybe get the whole family together for a Bible story time. On Wednesday, you will have the chance to do a ton of super cool activities that focus on this lesson from this little story, as well as this week's theme. God can use you whatever size you are. But for now, I want to circle back to something we talked about last week. One of our big ideas for BBS, VBS this summer is to use our creativity to work on the very, very serious problem of hunger. There are people all over this world who struggle with having enough food to live. This is certainly a really big problem to tackle, but we know we can do it because God created us to be creative and God said that we are very good. That brings us to my next segment for this VBS opening video. I call this segment Talking to the Experts. Each week, I will have guests who are experts in helping to fight the worldwide problem of hunger. Now, last week, we met Gordy Goat, who told us how goats and an organization called ELCA World Hunger are working all over the world as God's helpers for people who are having trouble finding enough food to live healthy and productive lives. This week, we will meet not one, not two, but three of God's helpers. But before we meet them, I need to introduce you to my daughter, Alyssa. Alyssa? Now, hi Alyssa. Now, Alyssa is with us today because, well, she is here to translate because unfortunately, I don't speak the language um, of our guests and she does. So, Alyssa, welcome to the show. Thanks, Dad, or should I call you Mr. Mike? Either way, it's great to be here. Super. Um, so let's get on with the interview. Uh, joining us all the way from Webster City, Iowa, please welcome the Chicks. They said they are happy and excited to be on the show. Wonderful. Uh, so to be clear, they understand me, right? Yes, sir. Feel free to hit them with questions. Great. Uh, how about we start with their names? Okay. Well, we have Click on the left, Cluck is in the middle, and Steve is on our right. Well, you all are certainly adorable. You are so tiny, though. And yet, I'm told you are also pretty awesome when it comes to being great helpers. Could you explain this a little bit more for all our viewers? Steve says that they are actually just three of ten chicks that a family can get when partnering with ELCA World Hunger. In fact, they expect to be leaving any day now to join a family in need. 
So I'm wondering, how exactly do you provide help to a family in need? Cluck says since they grew up really fast, they are ready to start laying eggs within just a couple of months. Eggs are super high in protein, which makes them a great food source for a well-balanced family meal. Oh, and Chick just added that because there will be 10 of them, they will lay a lot of eggs, which means there will be extra eggs that families can sell at the marketplace. That means more money for school, fees, or medicine, or expanding the farm. Wow, that is super awesome. How hard will it be for the family to take care of you guys? Steve says they will be super easy to provide for because they'll eat just about anything, especially bugs. And eating bugs helps to keep the bugs from messing up the family's other crops. <laughs> Steve, you're so funny. Steve wanted to make sure that you also knew that their poop makes a great fertilizer. <laughs> Whoever said poop was a bad thing doesn't know much about farming. You guys are incredible. I'm sorry I ever underestimated you. You might be tiny in size, but you are big helpers. You all certainly prove that God can use you whatever size you are. You guys are superheroes. Thanks for taking the time to join us today and teach us a little bit more about how ELCA World Hunger is making a difference in the lives of people all over the world who are struggling to find reliable sources of food. <laughs> they said they were glad to be here. And then they started arguing about who was the most adorable. <laughs> I'm not gonna get into the middle of that debate. Maybe we can have the kids vote on it Wednesday night. Well, there you have it, my friends. The three chicks, Chick, Cluck, and Steve. Not only are they adorable, they are superheroes who might start out small, but they pack a lot of potential. They really are powerful partners with ELCA World Hunger, working together to find ways to end hunger. You know, I think the biggest thing that I learned is that your physical size doesn't matter if you are kind, caring, and compassionate. We can all make a difference and work together to build a better world for all of us because God can use you whatever size you are. So don't forget to join us on Wednesday evening when you will have more opportunities to learn about the ELCA World Hunger Program and chicks like Click, Cluck, and Steve. Well, that's it for me. On behalf of Click, Cluck, Steve, and Alyssa, I'm Mr. Mike, and I'll be back here next week for another God's Good Creation VBS opening video.